one kid who's not my friend, uh, one who we were little and we didn't get to know any, we didn't know each other very much. He pet my hair and said that your hair feels like a sheep and sometimes that can be racist. Do people touch your hair a lot? Yes. Yeah. Do you like it when people are always in your face and touching you? No, not that much. Yeah, and it happens a lot, huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I wish I could see more people that look like me, actually. Yeah. Just some people at my school. Yeah, you remember, you usually know how, how many black kids are at your school? Let's check. Wait. Okay, How many do you think? About how many? Four. About. Four. Yeah, four. There's like 568 kids at Pacific. Yeah, and only four in my class. And only four who are black. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, like, it doesn't feel bad. It doesn't feel, make me feel sad. Just I wish I could have more. Yeah, you because know, my skin's more dark so that they can recognize me more. Because I'm like, because my skin splits out a little bit more. Um, a lot of people who want to, like, ask you questions and I'm trying to get away from them. <laughs> I've learned about Martin Luther King. I've learned about Mayor Tubman. I don't know. Mm, probably not. No. Yeah. Do you wish you learned more about that? Yeah. 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 We're doing a project where we had to make something about our ancestors, and my teacher asked about, um, do you have any ancestors like immigrants? And sometimes that can be racist because I, my ancestors came as slaves. So could you make a paper doll of your ancestor? No. That immigrated? No. No? How'd that feel that you couldn't do the sign that everybody else could do? Sad. But what do we do instead? We made flags of my ancestors and where they came from. So what flags did we make? Jamaican. And? Nigerian. Yeah.